Today we're going to be looking at some commands via the command line in Fedora 31 server. First thing I'm going to do is log in as root. Once I'm in as root, the first command is going to be the man command. That's actually for the manual or help files. So I would type in man, and the command we'll choose to get the help files on is ls, or list. There it goes, it shows us the different switches, the different things that we can use with this command. And, and that's applicable to most if not all the commands within Fedora. I'll type in Q, quit, now I'm back out. Now I can go ahead and type in ls, enter, and it's gonna show me what's on the root. And at this point, there's nothing much or nothing that's very visible, so it's very small. If I wanted to look inside of a folder, and we'll use the four slash etc folder as an example, I can type in ls space forward slash etc and just type the path, type an enter, and it's showing me what's inside that folder. And I've not entered that folder yet. If I wanted to enter the folder, I would type in cd space forward slash etc, enter, and now as a prompt shows, I'm inside the etc folder. And I would type in ls, enter, and I'm seeing the contents. To exit that folder, type in cd, enter, and we're back out. To make a directory, I would type in mk, dir, we'll use 1234 as our name. Fedora gives us no prompt or no confirmation that the file's been made, but if I type in ls, I see our 1234 directory. To remove the directory, I would type in rm, dir, space, 1234, enter, and again, no prompt, but with an ls, I see that our directory is gone. Fedora uses another command that Fedora uses is, is DNF. With DNF, you can use DNF install or DNF upgrade. The DNF install command installs specific packages. The DNF upgrade looks at all the packages. Right now, I will use DNF upgrade. It's going to go out all the repositories and see what's available. They'll give us a summary, then ask us if we would like to install them. For the purposes of this video, I will say no. Shutting down a Fedora server all stems from the shutdown command. If I type in shutdown and nothing else, if I hit enter, it's going to do a delayed shutdown. If I type in a shutdown space minus R, it's actually going to do a delayed restart. If I type in shutdown space and now, it will actually do a immediate shutdown with no delay. I can also switch that for a zero. If I type shutdown space minus R space now, it'll restart it immediately. The same thing I could substitute the now for a zero. Those are the basic commands inside of Fedora.